What's up guys? Welcome back to Digital Dive In. My name is Monkey and today due to some difficulties, it is just me showcasing the free games of December for PlayStation Plus. I've been inside baseball for you guys. We did this earlier today, um, and I had Sam Prodigy on, but for some reason it didn't record at all. <laughs> so uh, I'm back and because he could not come back it's just me and I apologize for that but we're gonna be showcasing or we I am gonna be showcasing the free games of December for you which were Onrush and Soma so I did a little bit of uh, Onrush today with uh, Jules and it was great it's a lot of fun it's a really cool game uh, but the online matchmaking is absolute garbage <laughs> So, for that reason, I'm going to do my best here. Um, I'm garbage at this game, like hot garbage. I'm going to use Dynamo. So, I apologize if I'm, you know, horrible. Actually, no, I don't apologize. I'm a garbage player, and you're just going to enjoy watching me suck at this game. <laughs> it is a lot of fun, though. It's fast-paced. It's crazy. Uh, it's super arcadey, but that's okay, because sometimes, you know... We need some of that in our lives. <laughs> but I'm going to see if we can actually get into a game here. Uh, the first time we played, it took us like forever to get in. And hey, look, we're in. Awesome. All right, let's get this shit going. I like how it starts you right off, like going. I, f I think that's really cool. Now we need to fucking get into the gates. Woohoo. Ooh. And so far, I am sucking. The first time I played this, this game mode was fucking fire. And I was actually not bad at it. But now it seems I've gotten a little shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> That's not good. Uh, I want the same car. Whee! Does that not count? Whee! Bitch. Oh, no! <laughs> I am not getting any of the gates because, oh my god, I can't do anything. Oh no, fuck you. Get out of here. Oh, come on. <laughs> Let's try this again. Let's try this again, boyos. I'm, I got a different car. I like testing out the different cars and the different stuff that they have because I think that's fun. Hey, -o. did I kill can anyone? The goal of this game is to fucking destroy the other team. Also, your boost is like almost not quite immortal, but it's close enough. Woo! Hey! -o. Oh, is that a double? Did I get a double kill? What up? Oh no! Oh no! Ah <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> That's oh no! Fuck you! Oh, we lose. Oh, damn it. <laughs> I died, too. All right, so it's 2-0. We... My team sucks. Wink. Did I get time at it? Yeah, I did. All right, come here. I want you. I'm coming for you, big boy. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, god damn. Okay. How did I wreck? How did I wreck? That's some bullshit. Oh my god, <laughs> what the hell? Oh, god damn it. Two takedowns, 21 gates hit. Like I said, the first time I played this, I was a lot better than this bullshit. This is embarrassing. Um, but, oh well. Okay, let's see if we can get into another game. I doubt it. Because, like I said, you almost have to, like, close out the game, restart it, and then get into another match, because otherwise it's not going to work. It's just going to keep on failing matchmaking, and it's annoying as hell. I got a new little thingy. It's basically a loot box. For a $60 game, I hate that there's so many loot boxes and microtransactions in this. It's kind of annoying. I've only played Countdown and another one. I forget what it was. It'll load everyone in and they'll still say waiting for players. I'm like, but why? Three switches. Yeah, match ended. See? This is bullshit. Alright, let me see if this works, guys. Hold on. Alright, so, um, yeah, I ended up 
closing out the game and jumping into another one. So I'm going to see if we can actually get into this game now. Like I said, I don't know why it works like that, but it does. It's really annoying, though. It, the, the matchmaking is so shit. Like, that makes me almost not want to even play this game. And that's real disappointing. That's the issue I had with fucking uh, Battlefront. Not Battlefront. Battlefield 1 as well. Like, a lot of times, like, the matchmaking for Battlefield 1 was horrendous. And it always was horrendous. I don't know why they never fixed it or did anything to even fix it, but... Either way, um, <laughs> let's see if this works. Join a game. Okay, okay. Waiting for players. Okay, okay. Yeah, hey, we're in. Fuck yeah, baby. Overdrive. This one's fun. This one's real fun. Hey. Bitches. Oh. Hey, got him. Oh, I can't see. Oh, I don't like this map. This map is insane. Woohoo! Bitches! Fuck you! Fuck you, no! Ah, <laughs> damn it! I just got double teamed. That's not cool. So throughout the race, you have to be boosting. Otherwise, you're not going to survive. It's really weird. But uh, it's actually kind of cool. Oh, fuck! <laughs> God damn! Why do I suck so much, guys? Please, ask, figure out why I suck so much. God, the rain and everything makes it so hard to see anything. I kind of wish you could see or like switch your field of view. Oh, that was almost bad. But you can't and it's annoying. Ah, oh, damn it. This is a legit like a more violent version of Rocket League. Well, instead of hitting a ball, you're just racing. Oh, and also these little other car guys, they're just bots. They're literally there for you to destroy. And they give you like a boost on your uh, nitro, which is really interesting. It's a really interesting mechanic. I like it. Oh, that's right, bitches. Bring it. You really have to learn how to drive with boost. Otherwise, you're not going to last long. Hey, woo. Wink. Ah, oh, damn. Oh, no. <laughs> I saw that coming, too. As, as you use your boost, your little uh, your little meter fills up, right? And as it... God damn. And once it fills, and actually it's filled now, uh, you can go into like a rush mode, which basically makes you invincible. Like this. Woohoo. And this lets you like barrel through fucking everyone. It's really cool. But then once it's used up, it gives you like a super boost and then you can like destroy people very easily. It's a lot of fun. But you have to do it like, you have to do it at a good time. Otherwise, it's not gonna work out well. Oh fuck. Oh no! Damn! So this is basically like, there's no time limit. Whoever gets the most points wins, and you get points by fucking destroying everyone else. And ow. Um, hey, how's that knockout? I killed myself that time. How? How? He bumped me. What kind of bullshit is that? How y'all gonna say I'm almost dead just from a fucking bump? I'm on the same team, dude. Chill. Ah, fuck. Got him. What's up, little boys? Fuck you! Oh, come on! I almost had him! Oh! This is so much fun. Oh, fuck you! Woohoo! Oh, what? That's some bullshit. That's some bullshit and you fucking know it. That's fucking... Fuck you. You should have died. Did you die? Yeah, you did. Fuck yeah. Get out of here. Fucking fodder car. Oh, no! <laughs> Where did that guy fucking come from? Fuck you, dude! Oh, hell yeah. Oh, no! 
Come on now! Oh no! <laughs> I'm going off the rails! Oh, come on! <laughs> I fucked myself in that one. Woohoo, bitches! That's right. Oh, god damn it! Wait! <laughs> no! Jesus Christ! I was going too fast, Mom. I was going too fast. Come on! Come on! Nah, fuck you! That's some bullshit. That's a long fucking round. Holy shit. But yeah, so that's basically Onrush. Uh, there's a lot of other modes that you can play. Um, the ranked, this kind of stuff, is all randomized, so it's a random mode every single time you play it. But it's still pretty fun. It's, it's a lot of fun, as long as you can actually get into a game. Like, the hardest part is actually getting into a damn game, and I think that's so stupid. Oh well. There's a lot to unlock, there's a lot to do. Uh, quick play is closed during the rank season. That's stupid. Uh, you can do a custom game with your friends, or online, or split screen, I believe. Uh, there's local co-op to this, so that makes it kind of fun. Uh, ranked, which is what we're just doing. Then Superstar is the, uh, basically the story mode. But anyways, on to Soma. Time to get scared, motherfuckers. Guys, welcome to Soma. Time to get fucking scared up in this bitch. <laughs> uh, like I said, uh... I played through, I've been playing this actually quite a bit, because I love horror games, and this is a classic, this came out in 2015. Oh yeah, fucking, Onrush came out this year, and it's already free. That should definitely tell you something. Fun game, shitty online matchmaking. Anyways, Soma came out in 2015 by the makers of Amnesia, and it plays a lot like it, but it's uh, much more, the story's better, I think, in Soma. It's uh, definitely more of a uh, like psychological horror type deal, but it has a sci-fi thing to it too, and it has like a human side to it. Uh, you'll see what I mean. The story is really, really good. Um, and I, God, I hate that the other recording didn't work because it was I. We left it off at such a perfect point, but this, it, it's such a good game, and the story behind it's really cool. It's like this guy Simon uh, had a car accident I think uh, he had some brain trauma so he goes in to see his doctor for a brain scan to see what's going on next thing he knows boom that's a snap for you <laughs> boom he wakes up in this underwater like facility of some sort where it's been taken over by these like uh, like almost like a synth it looks synthetic it looks robot but like they take over robots essentially and make them, you know, psychotic, murderous, weird-ass motherfuckers. <laughs> and terrifying, too. Um, but also, you come across a bunch of robots who speak like they're human. And it's super weird. And you have no idea what's going on until you meet Catherine. Oh, this is actually starting me from here. This is perfect. Okay, cool. So, yeah, you'll actually get to see some of the um, story. Because I guess I didn't save this either. <laughs> but anyways, um, cute, freaky motherfucker. Oh, 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 fuck. That still freaks me out. Uh. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck me. Fuck, 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 fuck. Still fucking freaky. Oh, ha, 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 ha. Fuck me. I hate this. Fuck. Woohoo. Uh. No, not me gusta. No, fuck me. That's fucking terrifying. Shit. Oh. Can you please go away? Fuck. Oh. Fucking freaky, dude. I think you help. I don't fucking care. I don't want to come out. Fuck that shit. She's a fucking robot. Yeah. I'm right next to you. No, not you too. <laughs> I was really hoping you were human. Don't let the circuitry fool you. I was human once. Can't take it anymore. This is everything's fucked. I give up. There's nothing left. Calm down. It's not the end of the world. You sure? It sure as hell looks like it. For all I know, there's no one left except for me. What do you mean? I'm right here. 
Don't take Bitch. this the wrong way, <laughs> but I meant any humans left except for me. Have you looked at yourself lately? You're a walking, talking diving suit with some electronics left on for good measure. I, I don't. You don't want to think about it? We'll start thinking about it. I, I, I don't want to do this anymore. I don't want to be this. I want out. Before you do anything hasty, could you help me with something? What? I was trying to find out what happened with my project when that brute knocked me to the ground. Your project? How could anything possibly matter when you know you're a stupid robot in a stupid dead world? Okay, focus. I need you to fix me so I can get back to work. Then you can sulk as much as you want. You gotta be kidding, right? I think I have a better chance of building myself a time machine than of putting you back together. I just need to access the computer. Oh, is that an Omni tool you're carrying? Oh, the door opener? I picked <laughs> it up at Upsilon. The door opener. Yeah. I don't have to do. Plug it into the terminal. Sure, whatever. Sure, whatever. <laughs> this guy is just fucking is loaded, done just plug my with everything. Into the tool. What's a cortex chip? It will be obvious. I'll eject it for you. Just grab the chip and slide it into the Omni tool. Come on, I just need you to do this one thing for me. Sure, whatever. <laughs> sure, whatever. Terminal 27 activated. The Omnitool is ready now. Should be easy enough. Just pick up the chip and slide it into the Omnitool. Why does a robot chip fit a door opener? It's standardized connection. Uh, Catherine? Alright. If she was a regular a robot, I don't know why she has these fucking tentacle motherfuckers all over her. Like, this is the shit that's been, like, infesting, uh, the entire, like, everything, basically. This entire complex has been infested by that, those tentacle mother, motherfuckers. Those little guys. That's really creepy. No, helper Jane, no. Pretty much anything will fit. Oh, this feels weird. I'm in the Omnitool? Thanks. So, what's the project about? My project? Oh, well, I saved all the people on the station as brain scans and put them into an artificial world. We were going to launch it into space to save it from, uh, well, all of this. Are you telling me that you were going to launch a computer world filled with people into space? Yes. It was just a pet project at first, but it got really serious after the comet took out the surface. Then, suddenly it became very important, and it was officially named the Ark. That's appropriate. How far did you get? I don't know. That version of me that I am. It came from a scan I did pretty early on. The living Catherine could very well have finished the project and launched it. I guess she could even still be alive. Huh. Weird thought. So the talking robots, are they also scans you did? They could be, but I doubt it. I'd expect much more sense if that was the case. Ah, all right, finally. What's happening? I managed to restore some data from the backup server. This should tell us everything we need. Oh. Could you do me a favor and run into the other room and have a look? I don't seem to be able to view the files in this condition. I need to know that the Ark is safe. Sure, Cap. Thanks, I'll unlock the door for you. Before, you're from Toronto? Yeah, Toronto. I just went in for a brain scan and suddenly... <laughs> That doesn't make any sense. How? Why would anyone bring a scan from Toronto? You think that's strange? What if I tell you it was back in 2015? Whoa. But I guess some of the people got uploaded into these helper robot dudes. And I got uploaded to the, whatever the fuck I am. I don't even know what I am. She said a walking, talking, diving Say suit. something? Sorry, still trying to figure out how you got here. Keep at it. I'd really like to know who thought sending a Canadian to the bottom of the sea was a good idea. Like shit, I'm a walk, walking, talking, diving suit. So I don't even know what the fuck I actually am. I mean, obviously I'm not human. I don't believe. Who are you? Pills, pills to keep me insane. Oh fuck. Oh fuck is back. Fuck this oh, shit out of my mouth. Oh shit, is that thing? That motherfucker. What are you doing, bro? 
Get the fuck out of here. Kindly fuck off. What happened before? That creature was strangely overbearing. Yeah, it basically exploded with electromagnetism. That's bad for us, right? Confusing at least. Gives the senses a good punch. Okay. Oh, also there's these weird fucking alien butthole things. Um, I think there's one, yeah, there's one over here. Eh, uh -huh. hey, alien butthole thing. I don't know what these are. I've been touching them. <laughs> that sounds really bad. Uh, in the game, so, uh, when you interact with them and shit, so far he's just been like waving his hand over it or slightly poking it. Then like... The last time I touched one, it like ate my hand. So now he just fucking sticks his fist in it. Look at this. This is fucking weird. Look at that. I'm like, fuck. Why would you fucking do that? Sometimes it sends like a electromagnetic pulse and destroys some shit. Other times it just doesn't do anything like that one. Uh, this is arc. Okay, this is where we get to learn a little bit more about what the fuck is going on too. Uh, these are people talking about like wh what they think about the arc idea. Are you excited about the arc? At first, I couldn't really see the point of it. But then I thought, why shouldn't we, right? I mean, if we are able to save even just a small piece of ourselves, why wouldn't we do that? So you are in favor of that. I think it's really important we do this. Look at that date, July 2103. The game started in Toronto 2015. So, what the fuck? Finally, we have something to do. Am I right? Are you optimistic about the project chances of, um, about the arc reaching space? Yeah, it can definitely be done. You already solved the biggest problem. How to actually get us all in there. Now, all we have to do is build the damn thing. And Hope Phi is still operational. Yeah, I think we can do it. But it's not going to be easy. What are your thoughts on the art? This guy gets real existential about it, too. The idea is just incredible. By every definition. <laughs> it really makes you think about what it means to be human. What makes you say that? Beyond the basics. Beyond the superficial. I'm convinced there's something with even greater value. You have provided a platform which is not necessarily restricted to our digital progeny, but a means of actual survival. It's my sincerest belief that we can go on living through the reality of continuity. That's heavy stuff. I found a tracker homed in on the Ark. Oh, that's clever. I wonder if I thought of that. Oh, wait, no. Oh, wait. Hey, there we go. Cool. It's on Tau. Where on Tau? Oh, outside Tau. I'm going to go to the biggest room. Hello. Hey, tool. I'll just carry the door opener. You'll show me what to do. There's a motherfucking door opener, bitch. Besides, I don't like the idea of you carrying me around. Come on, Catherine. This is what you wanted to do. Your final mission. Let's launch the Ark. We would need to find a way to get into the abyss. Can't date the climber without a power suit. We probably have to go to Theta and pray the Dunbat's still working. Okay, so we go to Theta. <sighs> this guy's just going along with everything. Like, yeah, that sounds good. Around. What else is there to do? You know what? I found a sunken vessel just outside. Uh, that could take us to Theta. Really? Didn't look completely out of action. It even lit up a little when I tried the Omni tool on it. Okay then, let's have a look. I'll just eject from this thing. Don't forget to take me with you. Let's go, bitch. Can I pull the Omni tool out? Wait, wait, wait. Okay, just be sure to plug me in again at some point. You got it. Good luck, Simon. <laughs> Here's a question. If I'm not human, why are these robots still attacking me? Hell, why are these robots still attacking uh, Catherine if she's a robot? That don't make no sense. All right, come here. Boink. Oh, no, come on. Come on, close, close, close. Oh, well, fuck you then. Hang on, I'll give it a try. 
fucked up. <laughs> How long has this thing been here? Sorry, it's dead. What Fucking shot? great. The CV came from Curie. It was a ship that used to make runs between Lambda and Lisbon. Looks like their wreck is close. Maybe you can find a vessel like this one inside. Sounds like a plan. I'll just save the security information and update the Omni tool. There. Should help you get it around. Great. Dope. Alright. There's no map or anything, so you're just kind of on your own. Just say, hey, um... Uh, oh, shit. Evil robot. Is that an evil robot? It's not red. It's just chilling. I'm assuming I'm gonna go this way. Let's see what happens if I just go this way. I forget which way I came to get here. Oh, fuck! Oh! Oh, fuck you, dude! Fuck you, dude! How are you underwater? Nah, fuck this bullshit! Oh, fuck me! Okay, so I'm assuming the seeing that guy means I'm going in the right direction. Uh, I'm gonna say big red light. Big red light it is. Hello, buddy. There's not a lot of jump scare jump scares in this game. It's kind of like gradual jump scares. Like, it always keeps you in a state of suspense, which I actually prefer. I think that's a more... I think that's a better... Uh, horror tool than jump scares. Jump scares get overplayed and boring after a while. Where the fuck am I going? Oh, oh I'm stupid. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Oh, oh no, 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 no. I'm getting the little fritzies again, and I don't like this. What the fuck was the point of that? I thought that was a crash ship. It is a crash ship. I'm confused. What? Where? Where? Where is he? Is that him? Okay, I'm uh, up. Uh, fuck. It's just kind of. Fuck me. It's just kind of there and it fucks with your head. Do I have to go towards him? Oh, fuck. What the fuck? I don't like this. Also, why am I hearing a heartbeat if I'm not entirely human? I don't know exactly what I'm looking for, but I guess I'll know it when I find it. Like, shit. What? 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 What's going on? Why? 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 Why the music? Fuck you, game. Freak me out from- Oh, fuck. Where? Where is it? 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 See, it's fucking with my game. Fucking with my head. And I don't see shit. Like, why? Okay, well, I guess this is the opening. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming, just keep swimming, swimming, swimming. Please don't fall off the edge. I love all these doors are just open. I mean, they crash, but just don't. No, 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 no. Fuck you. Oh shit, it's saving. I don't like that. Don't save. All right, we're in. Let's find a working escape vessel. Oh fuck that. It's locked now. And it's saved. I don't like this. And it's saving again. Oh, fuck me. That means there's a good chance. Some, anything, something behind this door is going to kill me. Right? Oh, something in here is going to destroy me. Watch. Oh, fuck me. Fuck me. Nope, nope, nope. I'm fucking good. What the fuck? Stop. Fuck off! Oh shit! Nope. Nope. I am fucking right! Oh shit! No! <laughs> Fuck this shit! Fuck this shit, I'm out. I'm just gonna hide in the corner. You don't see me, I don't see you. You don't see me? Oh fuck, there's nowhere to hide. No! <laughs> no, I don't like it! I don't like this. Is he fucking gone? Nope. Oh shit. Okay, you don't want me to look at you? I won't look at you, don't worry. I'm not gonna look at you. I'm fine. Uh, there's nowhere to hide, it is the worst. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to look at you, sir. I'm scared to turn around. Is it gone? Oh, shit, okay. Hello, dead guy. Hey, look, Mr. Skull. Go. You're free. 
How is this shit? Oh. Fuck this shit, I'm out. Uh -huh. Holy shit! Okay, um, uh, <laughs> I don't like this anymore. Nope, I'm good. I'm fucking good. I am 100% okay. Uh, that's Soma. <laughs> I'm fucking terrified. Um, I need uh, to go see my wife. Um, anyways, guys, let us know all your thoughts about uh, free games of the month for PlayStation Plus. Whether it be on Rush or Soma, let us know which ones you are enjoying personally. Let us know any of your thoughts down in the comment section below. If you like this video, please swipe right on that like button. If you're new to the channel and you want to see more of us diving into the latest news surrounding TV, video games, and movies, as well as doing opinionated sectionals as well, please hit that subscribe button, hit that bell so you get notified whenever our videos go live. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Stay excellent, and we'll see you in the next dive-in.